So guys, here you can see it. One more video has been came about the machine learning. I know I am uploading machine learning video like two to three or four the days. Yes, uh, but uh, now I'm uh, I'm uh, uploading uh, machine learning video today and tomorrow I'm also uploading machine learning video. So do not take a stress. But uh, the main topic is in today's video I'm telling about what are vectors in machine learning. Like in the previous video of machine learning, I told you about the linear algebra and from the previous video I told you about the linear functions. Now in today's video I'm telling about the vectors and uh, uh, their ending is started of the machine learning. So get ready for that. Okay. So now like next week our machine learning will be ended I I think so okay so but anyways I please like this video share your friend and subscribe to my channel and do not forget to all the notification bell also so never miss our future later videos so but I do not take a long time so let's move from our screen and let's do according with loving so guys here you can see even more videos we came about the machine learning and in today's machine learning video, I'm telling about the vectors. If you don't know what are vectors in machine learning, so in today's video, your whole concept will be clear about it. So without wasting our any time, let's move, uh, let's start and let's, I, uh, let me tell you about the vectors, what are vectors in machine learning. And uh, let's start. Now, vectors are one dimensional array, okay? One dimensional array, uh, the vectors are one dimensional array. Vectors have a magnitude and a direction. Number three, vectors typically describes motion or force. Now, vector notation. Vector can be written with uh, in many ways. In many ways, the vector has been noted. The most common are like this one, the most common. First is like V equals to 1, 2, 3. This first of the common and number two is this type of. In this two type of methods, the uh, vectors can be written. Here you can see it. Vectors in geometry. The image to the left is a vector. The image to the left is a vector this one vector i have made it the length shows the magnitude okay the length is showing the magnitude magnitude of the arrow the arrow is uh, showing the di uh, direction okay like that this uh, image it is the left is a vector uh, to the left is a vector uh, then the length this is the length of the arrow it shows the magnitude and the arrow arrow shows the direction okay like that now come down motion Vectors are the building blocks of motion. Like in geometry, if you study the geometry, a vector can be described a movement from one point to another point. The vector 3, 2 say is say go 3 right and 2 up. Okay. Now means that uh, 3 is go 3 uh, right, uh, 3 go right and 2 go up. Okay, like that. Now let me tell you vector addition. The sum of two vectors. What is the sum of two vector? Means when we sum two vectors, so what is what uh, what which the output will be came? Let me tell you. The sum of two vectors a plus b is found by moving the vector b until the tail meets the head of a vector a. This that does not change vector b. Okay, this does not change vector b. Then the line from the tail of a, a to the head of b is a vector a plus b when we do a plus b so this type of one diagram has been came when you do when you sum your two or two vectors so then your output will be come then your diagram will become like that here you can see now let's come on down vector subtraction vector minus a vector minus a is the opposite of plus a this means that vector a and vector minus a has the same same magnitude in opposite directions in which direction in opposite directions like this one example like it is the same direction but in the opposite direction like uh, a is coming like in the straight like that and the minus a it is coming in the opposite direction of the uh, a okay here you can see this means that vector a and vector minus a has the same magnitude in opposite directions and here is one diagram. Let's come down it scalar operations. Vector can be modified by adding, subtracting, multiplying a scalar number from all vector values. Like this one example here we are equal, here we are doing equally and here I am plus uh, plusing and here I am also plus three e values with uh, one value. Here you can see it. Vector multiplication has just, uh, such of the same properties as normal multiplication like that. 
फेस एंड मल्टीप्लीकेशन विद डिवाइडेड बट एनी वेज लेट्स कम डाउन फोर्स फोर्स इज अ वैक्टर वॉट इज द फोर्स फोर्स इज अ वैक्टर इफ यू स्टडी ऑफ द फोर्स फोर्स इज अ वैक्टर फोर्स इज अ वैक्टर विद अ मैग्नीट्यूड एंड अ डायरेक्शन वेलोसिटी वेलोसिटी इज अ वैक्टर वॉट वेलोसिटी इज अ वैक्टर वेलोसिटी इज अ वैक्टर विद मैग्नीट्यूड एंड अ डायरेक्शन ओके so this in today's video we learn about the water vectors in machine learning so i hope your concept will be clear about the water vectors in machine learning if you enjoyed this video so please like this video share and subscribe to my channel don't forget to all the notification bell also so in our most of future related videos so but i am using next class and next year i am using class that our videos so but for today go bye